Hello and welcome to something completely different. Um, H Wonders Planet Fall Invasions released like a couple of days ago, and I just didn't notice. I failed to notice this release, and I have even no clue what it's about. I think I missed like every single news bulletin that was presented about this. Uh, and I have no idea why that is. So I actually don't even know what this DLC is about. But it is here, and I thought let's uh, experience it together. Um, so let's go over some new features that we can apparently got the shaken plant falls newest playable fantasy gift gives new meaning to cold blooded all right we're gonna play those a new npc race some new mission types some new world events new campaign missions and in team style juggernaut style mode what whatever all right so new planet uh let's see we got a one commander with extra resources is pitted against a team of others well that's an interesting um Boss at four? Game game intensity gonna be a little bit like relaxed? Because it's been a while. Uh normal, we'll do a medium-sized world. Uh a little random. You know, continents makes sense. Uh side, we are uh You know, we're one of the Allied commanders. We're gonna take out uh We're gonna take out the one. No, you know, yeah, you know, fuck it. We're gonna go solo. We're gonna go solo. We're gonna select a commander. We're gonna take a look at the new race of commanders. So, we got the new race. It's called the Shakarn. There we go. Lizard boys. And, uh... Well, let's just customize one. Uh, so, we are Shakarn. And Celestian, Heritor, Promethean... Number us and... Did we get a new one? No, we did not. Alright. So, interesting ship. What are we going to do? I don't think I've ever done Celestian, so... I think that is what I'm going to do. All right, so we've got aquatic deployment, long-term bonus, all racial tech resources faster. Cool. Infiltrates, operation center to steal racial tech trees, sound. All right. That's, uh, okay. All new weapons combine sound and laser technology. Use holograms to infiltrate, confuse, and mirror your enemies. And use broadcasts and propaganda. Amphibious units with... Amorphic regeneration. Okay. Sure. Uh, what, right, so... Let's see. Uh, martial tradition, weapon expertise, decreases weapon research costs. That's probably a good idea, considering that what we are gonna have to do. Um, I th let's see, cruel. What does that do for me? Party animal, stubborn. What does this do? You defended the science department and reducing the colony's knowledge generation. You teach your army how to refuse changes like you do, but we do get some resistance on that. Decadent? Ew. Uh, we need a little bit more food. I think that's more important because we need to attack. Uh, and I'm gonna say we have a military detachment. You start a game with a larger starting up. That's just a such a small time bonus, I'll be honest. Start with extra energy. Kind of like extra population. You know what? Considering that our early game is gonna be probably quite of a pretty much a bitch to get done so next up all right so let's see how we look we have a lot of backgrounds we but um let's see this looks like uh our race so let's go for posture yeah that looks fancy all right let's take a look at our head um there we go can i zoom in on my face all right first things first i think i'm gonna just Okay, so we just have pretty large torso. <laughs> a little bit annoying. Uh, right, what do we have? Wait, this looks like a, like almost like a bear. Um. Oh, there is a large difference there. All right. Um, let's see. I like this one. We don't have a skin texture, skin decoration. Okay. I'll take the the blackened eyes. We don't have any eyebrows, we do have horns. Ooh. Uh, the size of my horns. Okay. <laughs> you can take everything or a mohawk. We'll zoom out a little bit. Just gotta get really focused on it anyway. Uh, I don't want these side things. You know what? That looks uh, ridiculous, to be honest. Um. 
Yeah, that'll do. Hair color, red. Red goes into further red. What do we skin color like green that goes into red or blue? Is there blue in there? There we go. That looks like a proper lizard. All right, let's go to torso. Nope, nope, nope. Nah, nope. Eh, could be cool. I think this is some of the standard stuff that I unlock from other DLCs. Yeah, I'm gonna take that one. I like that one. And the legs. All right, I got that one and that one. And that doesn't fit with the torso now, does it? So. I guess I'll uh, go for that one. Head item. Yeah, none of these really interest me. It's gotta be the purpose of the face, do you, do you think? All right, so nope. Cape, no capes. Uh, kind of a, let's see. This just doesn't work, right? It doesn't f seem to really fit the well on the body. I like this. It does give me a fat belly, but meh. Yeah, yeah, nah. I don't like it actually. We'll go with this. No cape. Skin color is fine. I don't care much for the name, to be honest. So, uh, uh, I want a primary color to be blue, secondary color to be red, because it's the kind of same that we look like. Gonna save this commander. Its symbol is gonna be that because that kind of resembles me. Done. Ready your rifle, right. General. The Scarlet Scepter has chosen you to claim another planet for the glorious Shakarn Empire. Our agents have lived hidden among the humans for generations, preparing for the time when we could strike using their own inventions against them. That time is now, be it through dominion or deception. We will lift the veil and show these creatures the true glory of the Shikarn. Okay. Alright. Well, that's, uh, I guess, is what we're gonna do. Let's start the game and uh, make for Planetfall. That uh, looks very odd. Well, that's one way to uh, hide a fading animation. <laughs> Just create a lot of smoke. Alright, so we, we start with aquatic deployment. Um, Alright, so an army here, and we've got this guy. This guy can go over there and claim the sector for me yet. Uh, we could build a forward base if we had the resources. Makes sense. I'm a little bit too enthusiastic about it, I guess. Um, so, okay, we well, first want to get into the city for a second. It's been a while since I played this, so, you know, bear with me a little bit. So let's start with the first one is going to be about, ooh, maybe I should go for production and not for growth. So I'll put this one in, yeah. And we'll get them, these two going. And we'll switch it around probably a little bit. Um, all right, first things first. Let's, uh, let's start cleaning up, getting some experience. Um, yeah, we'll do manual combat, because I, it's one of the few. I, I prefer the auto combat in a lot of games like this, but my experience um, in this game, it's probably better if I do some manual work. All right, so Inferno Strike. So you're a melee unit, but you do have a dash attack. Okay, so let's uh, plunk these guys over here. What do I have? I'm also uh, melee focused. Okay, I need to get myself a weapon, a proper weapon. Dig in. Uh, your turn is ended. Shikari Infiltrator. Hollow Shift. Copy the appearance and abilities from target from a non-hero unit. Okay, so I can put this over here. What is this? What is your, your attack? High Impact Stagger. Alright. Defense Mode Evasion. At least always one point. Ah, I cannot copy you. Alright. So, we go for that. You... All right, you, you guys have a range stack. Good. All right, so at least got something that has range. Um, dig in. Flying unit. Uh, defensive mode. Recon buoy. Place reconnaissance buoy to target hex, making all enemy units and stickers very easy to hit for one turn. All right, and this is another same squad of these guys. All right, so we'll put them over here. And pick 
the defensive mode, and there we are. End the turn. Alright, so they all just entered Overwatch. Uh, it's a little bit annoying. Uh, they've got. Oh, wait, only this guy entered Overwatch. These guys just didn't move. So I can move these guys to right here. It does get them in the range of these guys, isn't it? Yeah. Doesn't get him in the range of these guys, so maybe I should. Oh. Okay, that's a little bit annoying. Anyway, yeah, you know, need to break some eggs to make an almond. This is uh, my light bringers. I'll uh, put these guys over here. Alright, dig in. Um. Again. Um, all right. I think I've hit the wrong key. There we go. So now I look like a different unit. Now, that's those. Oh wow! Just oh, that's pretty cool. Uh, we entered Overwatch with those guys and. Yeah, it doesn't cause me to hit his overwatch. Alright. To do some counter-attacking. Eh, they graze me a little bit. That's not that bad. I don't think I have any... I don't have any... Uh... Alright, that's uh, to be expected. Okay, managed to get some overwatch done there. These guys are just digging in and... Right, hitting with spike gun. But we all have the regeneration, that's true, yeah. Alright, so... Probably just gonna go for the hit. Alright, got some flame attacks, apparently. Let's see if I can get a... Let's have a flag going. Okay, they survived. You can do an attack, 35% chance to hit. You should be fine. Bam! And they're dead. Now you guys go run. This is a like proper solid cover, so I don't think they can shoot through it. If I remember correctly, at least. All right, uh, that's your turn. Are you, so you literally mimic the unit that you. That's really cool. That's a pretty cool ability. I like it. Now these guys got staggered three three times, so they don't have anything left. So end the turn. Okay. Hit, hit our leader, that's fine. Like, we regenerate some of our health, anyway. Hit these guys in the back. Like an Inferno Punch or something is what they do, it seems like. And uh, we'll use, use a leader to finish this off. Bam! Get to be down. Yeah, you sound weird, though. Um, Alright. There we go. Superior once more. Okay, that's, uh... Pretty neat. Alright, battle one. I need to actually take a look at my leader, because I actually have no idea. This guy has um Inferno Fists. That sounds awesome, but uh not really my style. I think I'd rather have you something with something ranged. Uh let's see what he got. A shotgun, a assault rifle, or a sniper. I think I'm gonna give you a this is just a regular yeah, like unarmed, basically. Uh, give him the Omni Carbine. Confirm the loadout. Get him some skills, and we'll give him Deadly Overwatch. Squad him fifty percent. Oh, that's cool. And Raid Specialist. Uh, let's start with that. Confirm. And uh, that's the turn orders required for you. Nah, you know that's uh, you can't keep scouting. I guess. All right, and oh, I start with. Oh, I start with a lot more than I thought. I that might be why the animation might be so weird. Uh, but you don't have a hero yet, so... So there, this sector in between, we've got one here and one here. Now, I would like to get that mining drill thing going. I think I'm going to go for a hostile intention, so we'll move, move you here. Go here. Let's see, central reactor core. Oh, that's energy. Uh, we'll do this. Uh, same as the other one. There we go. 
go. And we'll give you uh, a science hub. Because you need a little bit of science. We've got another four here. We'll march them uh, to this goodie hut here. Take the reward and we'll march them over here. So next turn, clear out this thing and claim it. And then we'll clear out that one. What is required for this one? Uh, that's okay. End turn. I mean, probably could be friendly, but honestly, I don't care much being friendly. So, do that. Yeah, your quest for human perfection ends now. Alright, I'm gonna auto combat this one. I think it's fine. Uh, we lost one dude. Uh, you know, this is why I usually. I got a lacerating shotgun. Oh, that's solid. I don't really care for the shotgun, to be honest. Uh, park you over here, park you over there, and move you in. Because I want to get experience on my leader, of course, so I'm not going to engage with these guys. Which required, yeah, you're just going to be fine. There you go. And, uh, you, come on. Give me you. There we go. We're going to just keep exploring. That reminds me, I'm probably going to move this guy out of the army and replace him with... Probably this guy. Yeah. I think I'm gonna get rid of this guy in general from the army. I don't really like... Um, I don't really like it. Alright, set up military research. Um, mm, portable scanners. Sonic, laser. You know what? Incinerator module. Sounds cool. Research. Uh, society research. Uh, plentiful procedures. There we go. And at the turn. I got some info, apparently. I guess the guy we attacked, it's, uh, it's over there. And we already claimed this one, so... Uh, Anisic for Supercox. And... There we go. Yeah, let's auto this. I didn't lose anything. Lightning Sniper, that might be good. It's a tier 2 weapon, we'll take it. Um, annex the sector for radiance, and we're gonna move on to this one, I guess, as well. Um, but I might not want to piss off every single neutral faction. Um, so can I? Yeah, I probably need to negotiate with these guys. All right, first things first, though. I wanna um, move you out of the army. And move you out of the army. And we're gonna move in whoop, you. And I'm gonna move in you. And we're gonna merge these two into one. There we go. Alright, you're gonna go there. And I gotta see what I can do about these guys. Alright, orders required for you. Just gonna keep exploring. Nearby, you know, get the goody hexes, that kind of stuff that are unprotected. There we go. Heavy laser applications. All right, select a new research. Um, you know what? Let's just uh, keep uh, keep it simple. Waters required. Oh, you're okay. If you can't go there, that's fine. Um, all right, this is just being done. All right, cool. Things are happening. Uh. Alright, so they're asking me, the space effects are violent gangs at Rome, blah blah blah, you know what, fuck you. Yes. I'll declare war. You filthy humans don't deserve to be alive. We'll uh, manual combat this one. Look a good idea to do this one manually. Let's see how that goes. This also looks like a new faction, I don't think I've seen these guys ever. Basically, these guys embrace the, the, the Mad Max style of uh, warfare. Alright, so let's move this guy in. And Overwatch. Of course, in uh, that direction. Uh, let's see. Some of these guys. I probably need to give them an item so I can allow them to Overwatch. Um, for now, we'll be fine. Alright, so let's move them in. And all right, let's see what the enemy does. Enter turn. Operations unavailable. Okay. 
Berserk chemicals, that sounds like a fun time. Okay. But these are melee units, so... Uh, first things first, hit these guys from here, and send them watch. And you can finish them. Enemy annihilated. I kind of like this, uh, this faction, thematically, it's a... Uh, Hollow shift, hollow shift, repeat. Hollow shift, the last unit in which suit was transformed. Oh! Um, can I hit the... No, I can't. Okay. Can you hit that on the hollow shift? No. I don't really want the... Uh, the truck, so... Alright, so we got some... Laser strike. High frequency projection. Project a sound. One hex radius that deals 12 damage with high impact. Units in the area non ethereal have 8% chance to become disoriented. Cool. So if I select this one, and I would hit these guys. Alright. Um. Well, that's the wrong button, but uh, it kind of worked for me. Um, defend, defend, and the turn. Alright, so we can take over the uh, the truck here. I don't want to keep the blast going. Now, you know what? Target camera to be mimic. Alright, so we'll, we'll, we'll blast these guys to keep them coming. Bam! And you'll hit this guy. You don't border me, so I think I could freely fire at you, but I think I'll just take a shot at the uh, thing there. Alright, then let's hit the. Come on! Okay, enemy is killed. Alright, good. Holy shit, we missed a lot. Anyway. Holy fuck, Nuggets! Would we won? Lost nothing? Troops got an upgrade? Hell yeah. Uh, old jetpack. Huh. Well, I'll take it. And uh, we'll claim it for the uh, for the uh, Iridium Acropolis. Cool. Alright, so, uh, yeah, we made a couple of uh, enemies here. <laughs> <laughs> we are not... Uh, eh, well, you know. No, uh, no, 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 no. Oh, wait, that's new. The exploring button. Auto explore stopped. Wait one turn. Guard. There you go. Yeah. So that's pretty cool because that was something that I, I I actually talked about in I think in one of the earlier uh, videos that I really like the ability to uh, to just have a, some a unit auto explore because that seems like a pretty useful thing. Now you actually go here and you. Why don't you go here and I'll put you on auto explore. There we go. Right, we got so some deafening frequencies. Uh, and we'll take the discerning systems. Uh, research that one. And we got Prandtful procedures. Good. Uh, let's go for Celestial Rain first. Furched? That's something. Alright, so we got some strategic things we could do. Dwelling imit intimidation. Uh, gain 10% discount when dealing with NPCs. Factions? Not really. Homeworld reminiscence. Get colonies gain. If a coastal or river feature is in their domain. So, you got a river feature here. Uh, you got it as well. And you got coastals. That's pretty good. Uh, so, let's start priming that one. Takes two turns. Um, you can take a new sector. Mm. Wait, what? Is that correct? Created a sector. sector no, yeah, we created a sector for you. You cannot create a new one. Faction war going on. Reputation change to untrustworthy. Eh. Empire task completed. Show the empire task. The invader declare war on an NPC faction. Kill two armies. Oh, alright. We pioneer award. Award for the first commander to complete. Okay. We got Shakarn Raider on it. I don't know if we actually got the unit. Oh, we did. Alright, we'll move them to here. Join with the uh, with the army. We got us a guarding stack, confirm the movement. Uh, where are you over here? Wait, did we enter in the meantime? Go explore. Go 
go explore. Um, oh, weird. You just somehow gained a lot of movement. <laughs> and they seem to be going for a goodie hut, so... Oh, it's like new research. Um, wow, our research is going fast. Uh, let's see. We'll go for pro well, for this one. We'll keep uh, keep it keep one at a time. No, I kind of want to you. Thank you. I'm control selecting these guys. Uh, sure. Okay. Uh, fleet. Good to know. Um, but what I wanted to do was come on. Can I get you? There we go. Build a forward base. Yes. Alright, so after that, I'm gonna put you on exploring. Um, yeah, you'll pick up the goodie huts. Oh, I was about 720, right? Now we're. Ah, we're not that powerful right now, but. Um, let's give you an old jetpack. And uh, the incinerator module. This user. The unit laser weapons. Have 10% strength chance for repeating attacks. Now, you, this is a laser weapon? E Sonic laser attack. So that works, I guess. And deafening amplifiers. This unit's sonic weapons. This is a sonic laser weapon. Fire combines. So this would stack. Interesting. Now, you guys have omni carbines. Sonic laser attack. So if I would, I could give you all an incinerator mod, mod all equivalent units. Uh, confirm. And I cannot modify you. Okay. And we confirm movement for exploration. Orders required. Yeah, we'll um, we'll uh, for now heal, and we're probably gonna go to the, the missile silo. Gotta see what we can get. So. Uh, uh, oh yeah, I got some movement left. Okay. All right, this is production there. Um, all right, that sounds like a plan. All right. Uh, cool. Cosmic stash. Uh, yeah, sure. I can use the influence now a little bit more, I guess, than anything else. All right, points are moving. Operations available for priming. Hmm. Automatic broke. Well, all colonies with formation tower gain. Huh. In addition, during combat, the domain. Oh, well, that's pretty cool. While active, affected colonies will produce less. Oh, okay. And the upkeep of regenerators. Okay. Um, nah. I don't think it's really useful for now. Now, what I do want to look at is mod you with deafening amplifiers. Can I mod all of my units? Yes. Good. Now you're all fully healed. Sector effects, fire still misses. Okay, so I'm gonna stay over here. Um, and on the next turn, we're gonna see if we can do some more modifications. Portable scanners. Eh. Damage abilities gain, 10% strength chance for repeating attacks for a lot. Literally, this mod grants you a little shield. Okay. Might be worthwhile, but I don't know. Yeah. All right, select a new research. Um, it's probably better if I add in the, like, the grenades or something along those lines. I don't know. Photon acceleration. I'm gonna not do anything with the Celestian stuff, to be honest. Um, ops are ready to prime. Like I said, I don't don't care for that really. All right, so are you're still working on your thing there. Okay. Right, because you two have production uh, things going, so you produce faster. Yes, sure. Alright, take the minerals. Hey, we got a vault here. We can go and dig a little bit. Okay. Alright, so... Celestial rain. Oh, wait, what? Oh, wait, this is from my doctrine. Of course, I get a little bit from that. I was a little confused for a second here. Um, let's go for area surveillance because we can get the operational factors, which gives us another doctrine that we can deploy, which is pretty good. 
Um, now, I think it might be smart if I move in the rest of the stack. Now, I don't know if, it's, if it works, but we're going to see. Add in the... Ooh, this unit laser weapon gains an extra level of stagger impact. This unit is mod the unit. I think that might be a bigger improvement. So, mod it and all. Confirm. Um, this is quite a large amount of power. Um, sonic pistol and thermal grenades. Nah, I think we're good. Nah, okay. Um, well, that I'm actually running 30 minutes already. Jesus, it's uh, gonna go fast. Uh, let's select some new research and we're gonna go... I'm gonna actually leave it up to you guys. Do you want me to continue this series or not? Now, there's gonna be only one video this week. If you guys are like, hey, I really like you playing some uh, Age of Wonders again, Plentiful, um, let me know in the comments down below and I will do more of it. If you guys are like, hey, you know what, stick with Harvest of Iron or whatever. I will stick with Hearts of Iron. So if you guys like what you've seen, let me know in the comments down below and I will uh, continue the series next week. So that should be literally seven days from when this video goes live. So with that said, I want to thank you guys for watching. See you hopefully in the next one. Uh, but that's up to you. So bye-bye.